Christmas, but I tell you what, I've never been sad at a Mexican restaurant. <laughs> it's kind of true. It is. It's just such a happy place. Right, now you're going to better get your encounter at the grass at the bottom of the hill. Don't forget to get Mega Kick and Mega Punch. Just give Primate both of them. Yeah. Full power. You'll probably actually want to run Primate against um, Misty. Unless you can get it... Wait, no, I think Sand Slash won't work very well because ground is weak to water, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, it is. Get rid of Leah. Low kick's good for like really bulky opponents, so like Snorlax, it hits super hard on. Right. Um, and which one do I want to get rid of? Uh, uh, what does Tackle do compared to Karate Chop? What do you mean, Mega Punch? So, 50 power compared to 80, and then 85 compared to... Compared to no, 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 no. What, what does Tackle do? Oh, Scratch. Sorry, not Tackle. You have Scratch. Um, what does Scratch do? Um, no, I can't get subscribers yet. Uh, Massacre, I don't... I need to get a... Um, I need to have a certain amount of um, average viewers, and I haven't reached that at the moment, so... Not quite. Uh, get, rid of, get rid of Scratch. Oh, you got five viewers now. That I do. Doing the, doing the business. Yeah. Jack Oz is currently on the road to affiliate. I'm just on the road to followers. Speaking of, are you gonna um plug yourself? If anyone. <laughs> would like to come and see my Nuzlocke that I've been playing, who hasn't followed me already, be sure to click on the link in the chat and uh, come and follow me. It would be much appreciated. And after Massacre, because he is the next person to get a Pokemon named after him, you will get a Pokemon named after you. So come and check it out. I'm playing Leaf Green for my Nuzlocke. Um, back and there was where your encounter was, by the way. Oh, that's fine. I just want to... So, yeah. Be much appreciated. You can uh, you can see me uh, running with a team of War Turtle, Wigglytuff, Pidgeotto, uh, Geodude, and Sandshrew at the moment. And I've currently had two deaths, so Jack's actually doing better than me. Mother. What will it be? Wubba lubba dub dub. <laughs> you deal with that, Spiro. My friend, that's all you. So yeah. Oh, and also, if you guys uh, do follow me and Jack, you will then get access to join our Discord, and you will get follow-up benefits from the Discord. <coughs> but then, of course, when we both get affiliate and you subscribe to us, you get even more benefits as well. Up to you. Oh, six viewers now, Jack Oz. Bloody hell. Six, fuck. Are you the only person playing Fire Red? I need to check this. <laughs> You're not. Give a nickname to Spiro. But... What am I gonna. Does somebody oh, wanna follow on. me right hang now? On. Yeah. If someone follows him right now, you will get named Spiro. So the Spiro will have your name. Oh, cheers, Massacre. I appreciate that it. That means a lot, mate. Yeah. That's we we just you know we play these games for fun, and but it it makes it even better um, when we can have people like you watching us. So we appreciate it. Obviously, no one wants to be named. I mean, who would want to be named after Spiro? Let's be He's honest. He's probably not even going to get in, to be honest. Oh yeah, you've already got a team of six. Um, it's a woman. Um, I don't know. Tampon. No. <laughs> Just a flat no. 
It was sent to the graveyard immediately. <laughs> That's because you closed the PC on the graveyard. Let's move Jesus it out of there, shall I? <laughs> Bloody hell. Okay, so there's actually a lot of people. There's 2.1k viewers currently of Fire Red Leaf Green. I should have been streaming now. There was over oh, that. There's, mind people you playing, there's people playing Kaizo. Oh, was there? Yeah. So you're currently in the list of them. You're within the first 15. Oh, first oh, really? 14. Yeah. I don't know how many people are English streamers though as well. Mm. Not to toot my own horn, but like the overlay that I've made you is actually pretty sick compared to the other ones. Yeah. Like some of them look absolutely dope, but like that one just stands out out of all of them, to be honest. Oh. People who joined at the right time, they're now going to be able to sit here while you... Um, grind. Yeah, while you grind your team up um, on speed up until you can face Misty. But I would grind up Mankey first because he's going to be your real heavy hitter. Even though he's not bulky, he's going to mega kick or hit hard when it actually hits. Mankey versus Mankey. Pidgey will actually kill it. Ah, uh, uh, yeah, so yes. his encounter was Spiro um, for this part, for, for Route 4. So, probably the worst encounter he could have had, to be honest. Yep. Especially seeing as he could have actually gotten Ekans. Snake backwards, my guy. Nope. Not gonna risk that. Definitely not. You could have switched. I oh, know. Spiro. Uh, if he has a fly move, yeah, he'll kill you. Uh, you're in crit range and death range, so I would change out because he outspeeds. Oh, he leered? <laughs> Jesus. Could have actually stayed in. I was That's not risking that. That's not the Pokemon oh, I Center. I swear I got pushed in there. <laughs> <laughs> oh, buddy, oh. Although, like, to be fair, I did actually have to sack Metapod, so that's why I have two deaths, not just one. Yeah. Oof. He'll kill you because he's flying type, so yeah. Always switch. A crit, though. gonna be so much better for you when Boris gets quick attack. Oh, yeah. Was he your wait where did you was he your route two encounter? Um mm. Jackals? Yes. <laughs> okay, I was yeah. confused then because I got Mankey before <laughs> but I went to the I was route two. twenty two. Yeah. I'm tempted to go to route twenty two and go, ah, oh, no, I won't. I won't go get the encounter there. There's no point. It means I'm going to have to walk all the way back to Canada to sell it on City, and I don't want to do that. Not even on speed up. Well then. Oh. That would have been a really sad message if he had died then. And just having to say, Mark, you died. Yeah. He'd be like, oh, especially I don't after, fuck. Especially after getting Mega Kick and Mega Punch. Yeah. Oh, we'll Mega Kick one hit. Ooh, it did it. Uh, so, Jack's been streaming for over a year and a half, probably. Oh, um, well, well but, over a year and a half, but I've been yeah. on and off. Yeah, so I used to stream 
like six years ago. Not the best quality stream though, if I'm honest. Oh, we both um, on GTA and stuff. Yeah, so, but um, it kind of got to about a month ago and we sort of just both decided, look, let's just start streaming together. We'll start with Pokemon. We'll see what, we ha what happens, what we do. So um, we've been pretty consistent. Um, we had like a week break in between streams in the middle of our first Pokemon playthrough together. Um, <laughs> between the last episode and then after, because after each playthrough, we actually battle each other on the Pokemon Showdown website with our um, championship winning teams, um, which that was actually a pretty good episode. I recommend going to check it out. Um, after this stream, so of course. Get, so happy to get sick in between. Yeah, that's that's how long it was that we didn't stream together. You got sick. Um, but yeah, uh, we're we're hoping to be a lot more consistent now. Um, at least streaming at minimum once a week, if not twice, as a minimum, um, would be good. Um, but I mean, Jack has a life. I don't, so I could probably stream more often than him. Um, but who knows? Maybe I'll have a life soon. So. But yeah, so we are, we just try, but it, and like, we're not necessarily only going to stream Pokemon stuff. Like there's other stuff that we want to do as well. Um, we just started with this because, well, we both thought it'd be a fun thing to do. And I've been meaning to get Jack to play a Pokemon game for ages now. So it was a good excuse to get him to play it. And it gave him something to stream. Yeah, exactly. So yeah. But yeah, are so. We, we have like a whole plan out that's probably going to take us like a year to do of what Pokemon games we're doing and stuff. So um, you kind of, you followed at the right time because you've only got one playthrough to actually really catch up on. And I will be um, uploading them in parts to YouTube as well. I've cut them up and kind of cut out, cut good. out the, uh, the boring bits. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, so if you want the uncut versions, watch the stream replays on either of our um, Twitch channels because we actually, our, our streams were actually pretty much the exact same. Um, we had the same uh, layout, oh, the same overlay. Um, Jack played Leaf Green, I played Fire Red, and then obviously we switched for the Nuzlocks. Yeah, it's pretty good. Um, it was, there was definitely Wherever some... first fatality. What, really? Boris died. <laughs> Boris got Boris. fucking... Boris! He got destroyed. Luckily, I Boris. got a zero. <laughs> I guess that's... Mission it. failed. We'll get him next time. I guess F's that's... F's in the chat. F. Boris... I guess it's kind of lucky that I got, um... Uh, Zero. Spiro. Yeah. Not that it really compares to Pidgey, but... You gotta have someone just take it out now. For Boris. Yes, F for Fallen. He's a Fallen ally. Or she. No, what, was it a she? Uh, yeah, so. Oh, uh, no, it was a male. Okay. Straight in the um, box. Yeah, I can't. I'm not gonna heal straight away. Um. <sighs> Where's the set? I was. I don't leave the box yet. Yeah, I was waiting for that. That's what I was like, oh, where's the the sad violin music? <laughs> <laughs> I'll have to make the screen go white. Like grey scale. <laughs> yes! Oh, poor Boris. Poor, poor Boris. Well, I mean, at least, you, at least you could get a crowbat as long as it doesn't go down. Oh, well. You're only sacking Metapod away from being equal with me now. Wait, did you put Spiro in your team? Yeah. I gotta get the sprite, bloke. It's kind of disappointing. Mm. That's what happens in a Nuzlocke. 
You've now experienced pain for the first time in a Pokemon game. Pain and agony. Freaking Boris, man. He's gone too soon. Oh, I just thought, mate, you thought he was gone too soon. I'm not even going to talk about Rattata. To find out about what happened to him, you got to go check out the Leaf Green stream replay. Fucking out with the bugs. Twitch.tv slash HM Injection. Don't worry, it happens early on. It's probably about an hour into the stream or so. At least your first Fallen wasn't the same as mine. What, Metapod? Or the rat? No, Metapod was not my first Fallen. As I said, to find out what happened. Go to twitch.tv slash hminjection to find out. Watch the leaf green replay. How many times do you want to plug it? <sighs> Mate, I am like an electrician right now. I'm Why not? Putting it in and out, you know. Also, oh, I beat God. the gym with my Pokemon at like level 20. I didn't even bother going to the level cap. Wow, you really need to strengthen the rest of your team, bloke. I still like half of them are like level five. Yeah. You really got to do some grinding. That's what I'm going to do. I'm trying to get Mankey up you first. Need, you need to change careers from a mechanic to a panel beater at this point. That's how much grinding you got to do. Wow. Absolute silence. Yep. Yep, right now. See you, boy. You're making people leave, mate, you know? Ah, oh, he wants to... Yeah, he did get the hidden red kit. As in, in Mount Moon. Uh, yes, I did. I just haven't used it. Yeah, he got the one that was in Mount Moon. I don't know if there's another one here. Can't remember. That's bad. It was only what? like... Only like, what, two weeks ago that we played this game? I the second like one? That. Where's the freaking second one? What? Oh! Back door of the house. Oh, and there's a back door of the house. Go up to the, no, no, go up to the top, go up to the top, go up to the top. And then come back down. No, no, no. Oh, wait, there. Oh, is it hidden? Up left. No, 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 go through there. Go back. Sorry, I'm behind on stream. Top left and just click A wherever you can find it. Outside to the right. Outside to the right. I can't find anything. I'm literally spamming it on everything. Third from the bush. Third from the bush. Oh wait, maybe it's- oh maybe- no, no, it might be in the house. In the house. Bottom right. Jesus. Hang on, what is it? Bottom right, up left? Yeah. Outside. Yes, I go outside. Uh, bottom right outside, I think. What, did you just press A on it? Yeah. I think you might have to stand still, though. So, Jeez, yeah. I'm just going to find where it is. I'm pressing it. Third from the left. I feel like I'm controlled. Third step from the bush. I'm standing on it. Yeah, I'm pressing. Hang on, oh, hang on. I'm you have to stand off it, it. There we yeah. go. Ah, okay. Thank you. You know what? I'm actually going to go get that in my one now. Right now. I know where it is. I'm just going to do it right now. Just for that. And you can get leveled up with the oh. rare candy. Give him both. Yeah.
He's just giving us all the secret locations. Yeah, I didn't even know that was a thing. You need to get, um, I can't remember, I think, I can't remember which Pokemon has pick up, but they actually pick up all the, um, secret items automatically as you're right. walking around. <laughs> I gave my one to Geo, dude. Nice, all good man. We figured it out in the end. Yeah, we got there. you would have actually gotten by now without me helping you at all. Yeah, I know Meowth has pick up. Let me check which other ones do. Pokemon with pick up. And fire red. Pick up the ability. Three and four. So the items it will pick up is potion, uh, super potions, ultra balls, full restores, full heals, nuggets, revives, rare candies, protein, PP up, and King's Rock. You have a 10% chance of finding a rare candy. Oh wait, that's Ruby, Sapphire, and Colosseum. You have a 5% chance of finding a rare candy in Fire Red Leaf Green. Trying to see where it is. Uh, I can pick up. Uh, Meowth has pick up. Um, <clears throat> who else can you get in this game? How is it? Uh, you could actually, if you were to get both Snorlaxes and breed them, you could then get a Munchlax, which has pick up. Wait. No, you can't. Munchlax is Gem 2, I think. So, yeah, the only one you can get that can actually pick it up is Meowth. Right. So you need me out. Pretty much. Better hope you find one. I mean, Persian was one of those. Um, those Persian starters. might Persian might not have it though on its own. You might only oh, get yeah. it from actually having a meow. And then once it evolves, it might keep it. Sort of thing. Oh wait, no, I think. Does it? It wasn't on Bulbapedia when I just looked. Rat Pat uh, abilities. Apparently, Rattata has Runaway and Guts. I don't know. I could have sworn Jigglypuff had pick up. Oh well, it's alright though. It's not gonna um, ruin your run if you don't have pick up. Just makes it easy to find rare candies. <sighs> I'm only going off what I read. I mean, I'm not denying what you're saying might be true or not. All I read was that it only has runaway and guts, but I don't know. The sadness is still in your eyes, Jack, because of losing Boris. No, I'm just like, I looked at the time and I'm just like, fuck, it's 10 o'clock. <laughs> you gotta hurry up and get Mankey up to levels so you can absolutely clap Misty. Stop switching to others, just use Mankey. Yeah, but when it's a... Alright, so what's his name? 
a water gym. No, I don't. Oh, uh, what do you call it? Oh, yeah, sorry, a Spiro. No, that's fair enough. You don't want to risk death. Yeah, I'm sure he will find one, to be honest. I think it is actually, I think he has an opportunity to catch one soon, I'm pretty sure. You know it would be hilarious, Jackos? What? Having Pokemon challenges um, critique your Nuzlocke. Like no. You. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, they can critique me all I want. This is literally the second time I've played the game. No, I know. He'll actually, he actually gives like good tips and stuff, though, to be fair. Like, he does it as like an educational type deal. He doesn't do it to make fun of people. Or well, at least that's not his first intention. He's still really good though to learn strats off and stuff. Like, I would never even have thought for just to deliberately kill a Pokemon to continue with the run. But you think about who's like the most like useless Pokemon on your team for that point in the game. You just further and you're just like, yep, that's who has to, that's who has to die at this point. Mm. But like. He did a run on Brilliant Diamond Shining Pearl of no deaths. So like no one in his team died ever in the right. whole game, in the whole playthrough. Anytime a Pokemon died, he reset. So like it's, it's he took it one step further than from just whiting out and resetting. He took it as Pokemon dies, he resets the game and starts over. Stuff. <laughs> he t it took him like a year to do it. I'm pretty sure. It took him a whole lot of attempts. Like I think he got to the champion fight, lost one time, had to play the whole game through again, and then finally beat the champion. Stuff. Which, yeah, it took me probably a good ten attempts to beat Cynthia on BDSP. Who knows, Jackals? Maybe you'll become a professional Nuzlocke. <laughs> I doubt it. Maybe you'll be like, maybe you'll be like Pokemon Challenges and getting drawn into a Jaden Animations video. His name is only a different letter and a new letter away from yours. Uh, no, so he hasn't faced, he hasn't actually entered the gym yet, so, um, but, so like, cause like our level cap system, I know people normally run their level cap at, it's once you face, like the level cap is for when you actually face the gym leader, but we just run it as the level cap is the level that you can enter the gym at, so like, if a Pokemon's level 22, we can't enter them into the gym when we first go in there, but as long as they're level 20 and bond or below, but then they can, but um, I think I'm trying to teach Jack to be patient and to actually not just rush because that's how you lose a run. Um, I reckon but yeah, nine is enough to fight some of the actual people though. I reckon you could. You could probably fight their trainers now. If you get Mankey up to... So make sure Mankey's at the start of your party. Yeah. Because you don't want to be starting with someone lower than him and having to switch since you don't have um, switch on. You didn't even check. No, because you just went used. for the first battle. Okay, well, that's alright then. <clears throat> so, yeah. You should be able to sweep them pretty easily though. Go back and make a punch for me. Kick. I would go for low kick. Oh, go for low kick because of the PP. Mm. <laughs> Don't you let it just like being behind? I know. I can't even give you proper advice. Mega kick. Or not. 
I would switch 100% go to um, squ I'll go to War Turtle. I would heal 100%. Nah, I just fight him like that, yeah. Yep, 100%. Just risk Mankey. Um, just put Mark's life on the line. How long does he have to level up? Not much. 267. You could you could probably just face it now. Starmi uh, Star is or Star is pretty low. Not pretty low. I think it's like level nineteen. Star is twenty one, but it's a tank. Right. So you just want to be able to make sure you can try and avoid a confusion hit. So as long as you're faster, which I'm pretty sure Mankey is actually pretty fast, you should be fine. Just go for Mega Kick and hope for the best. But keep an eye on their damage range as well, because if you think that you're in range of a crit, just swap him out because they could easily just get a crit on you and then that's it. He's dead. Yeah. So yeah. And like, take your time just to think about it and stuff. So I use Mega Kick. Don't next. rush. Uh, mega Kick. If Mega Kick misses, go for Mega Punch. Dang. Nice. Can that stab boot. Oh, wait. They're both normal, so you don't even get stab on them. I would go for Mega Kick on Stami. Oh, Jesus. How much did it do? Okay, what? I would switch. I would switch. Switch. Switch, do or do you want me to use a. Um, no, switch. Potion. Just switch. Just switch. If you want to potion it, go to Metapod, get the free switch, and then um, potion. It's not worth it, honestly. Yeah, so it's all the kill um, with Swift then. It's so fast, man. It is. You're not in range of crit though, so you're fine to stay in for right now. You're now in range of crit. Death. Uh, I would go to. You're gonna have to sack two here. No, do not heal now. You're gonna have to swap to either. I have a hard uh, Yeah, I know. Swap to Juggernaut. It'll. You can then switch into Micah and you can heal up over the turn of Micah. So you're gonna have to sack both of them pretty much, just so you can heal up enough to be able to survive. Nice. Now swap to Rotata. And then heal, um, heal, uh, water. Yeah. He's less likely to go And then you'll be able to bring water out next turn. How much does he get back from the super, mo from the super motion when you do it? All right, heal him and then you'll be able to bring him back this turn. Unless you want to sack Spiro as well and try and heal up with uh, Mankey. It's up to you. You could get away with not sacking Spiro and just bringing War Turtle out as the free switch. Yeah, I'm gonna do it. Use Bite, yeah. Okay. Yep. Yep. Nice. Did it kill? Yeah. Fuck yeah. So that's what three. Those are Nuzlocke strapped, my guy. That's now three. F's in the chat for the sacrifice made by Micah and what was Metapod's name? Uh, Juggernaut. And Juggernaut. It wasn't much of a Juggernaut though. See, that them some Nuzlocke straps, my guy. What's the new level cap? Ah, uh, the new level cap B24. Not only three levels higher. Yep. 
better hope you get a ground type as well. Because you're going to struggle against Surge. Yeah. And, uh, Warp Bitter. And Spiro as well, because it's a flying type. And Zubat, if it gets to Golbat. Hey, you know what? You make the sacks to get the dub. <laughs> like, you know, you just... Like, you know, sacrifices have to be made sometimes. Metapod was the most useless one on the team, and obviously, and honestly, Rattata was not high enough level to even just continue with it, because you were going to have to grind it up, so... Not even worth it. Chuck them in the thing. Hang on, have you actually put them in the PC yet? No, I'm about to. Alright. This is their death note. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> uh, Orft, what a graveyard you have. Poor Boris. He died for nothing. I reckon I'm probably going to end it here. That's fair. That's where I ended mine. Um, Let's see if Don't I can actually save. save on this. I know. Hopefully you can. Yes, it actually <gasps> saved on this one. Finally! You'll actually be able to go and try and catch Mewtwo for once. Hey, hey. You're actually going to be able to get your stats this time. Yeah. We could battle again with the Nuzlocke teams. That's six hours and six minutes, apparently. Dude, I went for five hours. How? I've only How been long have you two been? And a half. You've only been streaming for two and a half, but it, oh, it's because of the speed up. Ah. Uh, yeah, that's why. I was wondering why my game was, like, why my game time was so long when we played the playthrough. Yeah. Like, well, it's because of speed up. We're going to end it here uh, for tonight. Um, thank you to everyone that tuned in. And thank you, Massacre, for the follow and for being in the chat. I uh, hope to see you again in future ones. Um, be sure to check out Hamish's channel if you guys haven't already at HM Injection. And, yeah, I will probably be streaming in the next couple of days again. So... Yeah, I will hope to see you there.